COVID-19 is invisible to our eyes, but the impact it's having on our communities is very clear. This week, the Allegheny Highlands community is getting some extra attention as people stay inside. 10 News reporter Shane Dwyer is in Covington tonight, showing us who is getting the job done. The kitchen in Coochie's Pizzeria is rocking and rolling with orders piled high. Victor Cucci owns the Highland staple, but this isn't his typical dinner rush. I've been here 43 years, and that's the least I can do for the community. You think about it. In the face of the COVID-19 stay home order, more than 200 people are getting hand delivered meals. M3 militia formed in response to the Second Amendment controversy, but President Corey Clark says community service rises above. This is as really an eye opener as far as people that really need stuff and we're hoping to at least change one life and hopefully for the good. Crisscrossing Allegheny County, the group called upon the Salvation Army, local food joints and Sheriff Kevin Hall to help. None of them missing a beat. This is an, an unseen problem, invisible and uh, you know we're really working hard to try to be able to keep change how we have to operate but still help people out here. Up here the population skews a little older and people like their space. A concerning combination at times like this, but Pearl Miller feels the love. This is the third or fourth time that you've been by and I wasn't expecting it. And I am so thankful. I'm 81 years old and life is great with people like you in the world. Coochies and the others have been cooking up a storm for about a week now. Their own bottom lines are hurting, but they found a way to do this all for free. I don't want to say no numbers. None of them mean anything. Not in this time. In Covington, Shane Dwyer, 10 News, working for you. The Salvation Army is getting ready to lead the efforts. In the coming days, they'll switch from daily meals to a more sustainable canned food program.